Bonjour tout le monde. Bonjour. Hi. Bonjour. It's Sasha Blanchet and I'm today I'm with my mother. She's actually visiting us and um, I thought it would be kind of fun to show you how we cook here. You know, I love cooking and you know, this is one of my passion when I'm not out showing houses or negotiating a deal. I love coming here in the house and just taking time for myself. And, and today I have the pleasure to have my, my parents, my mom especially, that's going to be cooking with me. She's coming all the way from Quebec. As you know, I'm from Quebec, Canada. And today we decided we want to cook something that would be very typical French Canadian from Quebec. So we decided to go ahead and cook poutine. So we want to get started, of course, you know, for the poutine, the first thing we're going to do is take some nice big potatoes uh, from Idaho and just take all the skin off and chop everything. I uh, will go in and yes. so I'm not very, uh, very good, but then we love like chopping those into smaller pieces like that and make some nice big french fries so am i doing it right <laughs> yes so my mom you uh, of course speak french so yes. i'm not sure how your french is uh, very limited english but we're i think we're but that enough why? Uh, that's right so we go in and cut all the potatoes um very i don't take uh, man, uh plusieurs fois many time uh, put in because it's no good for me if you uh, eat often. It's, but it's not very healthy. Very so, it's healthy. so it's very yeah. fat and it's actually comfort food that yes. people use, yes. especially when you're out at the bar or uh, you're eating, um, you know, after like 2 a.m. and you had a couple of drinks already. So great, great comforting food. So we put all of those, of course, into put in the some water. water uh, here. Uh, uh, cold, cold, cold water. water. Yes, yeah. yeah. And when we're all done with this, we're actually going to go into the fryer and we're going to go in and put yeah. uh, the potatoes. We already have some prepared yeah. here. So now we're going to go take in all the fries, the potatoes, and That's we're going to put them into the fryer. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Now we'll take all of those. My hands are clean. <laughs> Then put all of those into the fryer. Okay. Okay, okay and we'll uh, put enough. them into the fryers and let that fries for a few minutes. What's very important to do on poutine is to make sure that the potatoes are fresh. Don't take the uh, frozen french fries and put in the fryer it's not going to be as good so actually the the real typical poutine is always always hand cut potatoes so sometimes i go to montreal and i see people sitting on on their chair and they're actually cutting them by hand as well so it makes it makes a big difference and it's always more fresh mm. usually when i do uh, poutine i usually put the uh, fryer outside because this actually yes. kind of brings some smell yes. in the house yes. the frying so i usually prefer to have it outside <laughs> cheers cheers oh, no, no. there's nothing better than a nice glass of french wine when you're cooking, it's very relaxing. And so my parents really enjoy their, their, their trip here. The weather is so amazing. And since it's already kind of snowing already in Quebec right now, so they, they really enjoy their time here. The beautiful sun. So we'll know when the french fries are perfect. It's when they're actually turning gold. So right now it's not completely ready yet. So we'll wait a little bit more longer. It takes usually about like 10 minutes. Poutine yes. is, a, is pretty, a very, very popular dish in Quebec. You know, you even go to McDonald's and they have poutine there on their menu. So, um, so every Quebecer knows about it, but as soon as you go out of Quebec, 
then nobody really knows about it. So even in Florida, there's actually a lot of places where a lot of people from Quebec are going. They actually open restaurants there that serves poutine. So we have a few very good places here in town that serve poutine. It's hard to find, but we know one place where I approve it and it's amazing. It's a short leash hot dog right there on 7th Avenue in the Melrose district. One of my favorite places when I feel like having a good poutine. Yeah. My mom has been, uh, has been there to teach me um, pretty much everything that I know about cooking. Soup. Uh, a lot of soup, <laughs> you know, yeah. because it's so cold in Quebec, so we like the, the warm soup. Uh, spaghetti, spaghetti sauce, Italian, yes, Italian yeah, uh, spaghetti, sauce. very, very good. Uh, Croton also is another really good dish. Uh, it's like a boiled uh, pork that you put on your toast. Very, very good uh, to start your day. So while the French fries are actually cooking here, I'm gonna go ahead and start our sauce. We actually use the poutine sauce from Saint Hubert. Saint Hubert is a very well-known restaurant chain in Quebec, and they have the best poutine sauce packaging. So you can actually buy it online or you can go to Quebec and buy it in any groceries. They sell that there. So it's very simple. All you have to do is put the package into a little uh, container like here. Yeah and you go ahead and add water to it. So all the instructions are on the packaging. So very, very simple. Yeah, well. So then you go ahead and pour that and have that, you water. boil that for about 15 minutes until it's ready to go and you stir it. So you've got to make sure you stir it. And um, that's going to be our sauce that we're going to be using when the French fries are ready. Okay. Parfait, it's très prêt. On va fermer notre... Not, uh, we're going to close our fryer, very careful, it's very hot, and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to be putting all the french fries into that big bowl here, and with a nice scott towel at the bottom, okay. I want to put a little bit of salt in it, what so we do have salt, salt okay. right here. Nice salt, okay, perfect. And okay, we're gonna remove some of the fat off the potatoes. Okay, so when they're out of the fryer, I'm gonna go ahead and take all those fries that we just salted and put them in each of the small bowl. Here we go. Perfect, and a little bit more, more on this here. Then we're gonna go ahead and pour, we'll put the uh, cheese. These are actually cheese curds. So, so they're actually uh, a little difficult to find, but you can still find those cheese curds. It's actually the squishy cheese, it's really, really good. So they have a lot of those in Wisconsin as well, but in Quebec they have some amazing ones too. So we'll go ahead and put some of the curds on top of the fries. All right, and when we have the cheese curds already on top, then my mom's gonna go ahead and pour the gravy Madame. on top. You can do it. Okay, and pour the gravy on top. So it's a brown gravy. Uh, I usually put about like two uh, of those, about one cup total. So, and I think we're good. And then we're gonna be able to try some of this. Mmm, can't wait. Mom, it's for you. And we're gonna go ahead and try it and see Santé. if it's good, Santé. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, very good. Mmm. Mmm, -hmm. excellent. It's not the most healthy things to eat, but it's very, very good once in a while. Mmm. Great. This is Sasha Blanchet with Sasha Blanchet Real Estate, the Inner Circle team. I am so glad that you guys were here with all of us, uh, with my parents visiting me in Arizona. Yes. And I hope you enjoyed it and feel free to reach out to us if you have any other questions. See you later. Mm -hmm.